during the course of the preparation of this Brent Toast discussion paper, we interviewed a large number of experts from business, from government, and from civil society, including academia, about the challenges facing the South African economy and some of the solutions that they identify. We asked Nkabisi Jonas, the former Deputy Finance Minister, and Haroon Borat, a member of the President's Advisory Council and a professor in the University of Cape Town's Development Policy Research Unit, about these challenges, constraints, and solutions. Fundamentally, our problem is with the, the, the political elite. Firstly, it's confused. Secondly, very divided. And thirdly, it has tended to veer more towards the failed uh, policy options that everybody has taken. If we do not address these things, my view is that I think in three years, I mean, this economy is going to crash. What government should do is view business less as an opposition, almost like an extension of the political opposition, and more as a partner in growth. I think, you know, the, the sort of old style uh, view of government, um, at least in perhaps to some extent in the, early, in the mid 90s, as a, a unit of the society that needed disciplining or that needed um, greater regulation and so on, rather than as a partner in growth. Um, I think has changed, and it's probably, um, again, gone through cycles, but uh, we're probably at that stage where that is happening again. But I think all of government needs to view um, the notion, for example, of public-private partnerships, not with suspicion, but rather as a way of doing business. Something we argue and realize has to change, and it has to go beyond micro-policy recommendations and fiddling, since this is only akin to really rearranging the deck chairs on the Titanic. <laughs>